All right, now to a warning you need to hear. A salad, of course, is a healthy staple of our diet, but it doesn't come without risks. Yeah, within the last decade, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention reported nearly 80 foodborne disease outbreaks linked to leafy greens. Here's our Nidia Han now with the details. This is not an excuse to avoid greens. Consumer Reports food experts say don't give up lettuce, just take a few extra precautions. We've got fresh um, romaine lettuce. We're going to take it all apart so that we get every ounce of it nice and clean. Lindsay Kirtland with Lindsay's Kitchen makes about 200 salads every week. I mean, restaurants, we don't set out to make people sick, right? And so we have to do our due diligence to make sure that our customers are well cared for because all we're trying to do is serve the community. Salad is something that we eat at room temperature because it's not heated. There is no chance to kill off the bacteria. Most recent romaine lettuce recalls are linked to E. coli and listeria. Contamination can happen anywhere from farm to table. Cattle can carry deadly strains of E. coli. Their manure that has the bacteria can seep into irrigation water and contaminate crops. No single type of leafy green is risk free, but hydroponic lettuces, which are greenhouse grown without soil, are less likely to be contaminated by bacteria from animal droppings. Even when leafy greens are grown free of bacteria, contamination can still occur during harvesting, processing, or packaging. That is why it is so important you take extra steps to protect yourself. Whole heads of lettuce instead of bagged greens might be safer. Whole heads don't necessarily have lower bacteria levels, but their inner leaves are less exposed to sources of contamination and are handled less than bagged greens. Refrigerate bag lettuce right after you buy it. It won't prevent foodborne illness, but it will slow spoilage. Buy packages with expiration dates as far into the future as possible and don't buy more than you can eat in a few days. All right, it's going to be twelve ninety. dollars Our cob salad is so filling. Another strategy, opt for leafy greens that can be cooked like spinach or kale. The heat will kill bacteria. This is particularly important for people who are more susceptible to the ill effects of food poisoning, like those who are immunocompromised, pregnant or elderly. I'm Nidia Han, Channel 6 Action News.